until the Second World War, Herbert Howes's compositional success was primarily secular, and he came to St John's as acting director of music, and it was the Dean of King's, Eric Milner White, who suggested that he should write a Te Deum, which was the, the celebrated Colreg Te Deum. <laughs> Herbert Howells always said that he couldn't write without a person or a place in mind and I think the Chapel of King's Cambridge was very often that place, the perfect acoustic, the perfect space, the inspiration of the architecture and the friendships that he had with people in this place.